hi I came back with the um, finished look I'm hoping you all can see let me um, adjust my camera but I went in and I just put on like a bare lip gloss I call myself doing a nude eye <laughs> but I got a little carried away so I just basically went in with a Mac um, brown I'm not for sure the brown um, and like a vanilla color here in the middle and around the eyebrow so now you can see the finished um, eyebrow look and like I said I do not use the um, concealer anymore to highlight my eyebrows but I just wanted to share that with you all the finished look and um, unfortunately I don't have the colors that I use I know the lip gloss I have on I think it's um, bear something uh, but it's like a little sparkly lip gloss just something very nude and simple and this is the Revlon color stay that's what I have on my cheeks I did this look in a previous video but I wanted to show you all the finished look of the whole thing with the bronzer the um, setting powder by Derma Blend and the Maddie Mousse. I love this. And like I said in my earlier video, that the lighting um, probably couldn't tell. But with the naked eye, I'm telling you all, this makeup is flawless. Uh, I had one of my um, friends on Facebook, and this also, I believe, belongs to my fan page. She, you know, inboxed me and said that I had her go out and buy the photo ready because it worked, you know, it looked so well. But I'm hoping she sees this one, Natalie, if you're out there. I hope you see this one. And I'm really in love with this um, mousse, the Maddie mousse. I mean, it's so silky. You've got to try it, you guys. It's really, really silky and soft on the skin. And I wore it yesterday to work. And it lasted all day. It really lasted all day. Of course, I said it. But it lasted all day. Now, yesterday, I did not use the... Um, liquid mousse and I forgot to mention this in the first video that I did that um, this is the airbrush finish I'm gonna try to get really close so you can see well it says airbrush finish here at the bottom and this again is the honey beige medium 4 I love these so I like to buy a variety of um, here lately rather I was once a Mac girl and I would just wear my Mac and when I ran out I just run to the uh, store to get it to the Mac store to get it but now I'm by trying these different foundations and realizing everything doesn't have to be on the professional uh, line of cosmetics you can take this and make it work and what attracted me to this Maddie mousse was I kept uh, seeing it passing it in CVS and I'm like okay I want something for clients just not necessarily myself but for clients so if I had to do a wedding or if I had to do a photo shoot will it reflect off the light or whatever so I'm staying away from the SPF 8s and um, just trying different things and I must say that I do like the Maybelline's liquid um, mousse in the pump and the Maddie mousse so I'm gonna definitely <laughs> probably have to go back and get some more um, but I just wanted to show you all basically the finished look. Like I said, I was going for a nude look today. I wasn't going to do any eyes, but I just decided, hey, I want to just do my eyes and just, you know, kind of finish the look. I'm going back to the CVS. <laughs> I'm looking for, today when I go to the CVS, I'm looking for a nice cold eyeliner pencil to really line the eyes. It'll go on really, really um, smooth no smudge or anything like that not unless I want it to smudge but that's pretty much it I just wanted to give you all the full effect of the um, I'm trying to adjust my camera of the um, mousse that I use the liquid mousse that I use hold on sorry of the liquid mousse that I used and let you see the end results and like I said with the eyeshadows I just did a like a vanilla by Mac here and like a brown by Mac here and that was it and I brought the vanilla of course up up under my eyebrows and once again I use the um, NYX let's see if you can see the medium brown 914 pencil and I just went in 
and I learned this technique from other videos that I saw and I think including Sam Fine and just went in with the brush and made it look even and this is bad I, I used to just use um, eyeshadow and an angle brush and that was fine but it kind of looked like uh, eyeshadow so one day I didn't have my eyeshadow with me when I was doing a video and I had to use a pencil and I'm like I think I like this you know pencil it's not as bad as I thought it was I just hate to see people with that one straight line across their face they've shaded all their eyebrows off and just make a straight line I hate it I like natural looking eyebrows and being that mine are thin the pencil and the angle brush gives me that natural fullness of the eyebrow but I just wanted to share that with you all and I hope you are enjoying my videos please subscribe I'm new to YouTube but I think as my videos go on I went back and looked at a, my very first one a day and I saw someone gave me a one star Whew, oh well you know but it was my very first video so please rate you know and subscribe and I will try to keep continuing to bring you new videos and new product reviews as I run across things that I like I have some more foundations that I'm gonna do a video on but I just really wanted to share that um, mousse Maybelline by Maybelline with you all the mousse foundation and I hope you enjoy it once again thank you for watching and please subscribe thanks have a great day